we're gonna be trying and reviewing the new box of birthday cake um, flavored Captain Crunch. So this is the Captain Crunch birthday crunch and the colors are yellow, blue, purple, and pink. So we each have a bowl. We also have our milk. Um, and so I'm gonna give each of the kids a spoon and they're gonna go ahead and open it. I'm gonna open mine and then here's a bowl for you, bowl for you, and a bowl for myself. Let's go ahead and open it. So these can be found at Walmart. It seems like I had to order mine and they had to be shipped here. It was shipped within two days. So let me open up my spoon, have it ready. Oh wow, they smell good. Y'all ready? Let's go. I'm just gonna pour like a little bit in our bowls and we'll just put milk over top of it. All right, so let's try one piece without milk. Okay. Ready? Mm -hmm. Here we go. One, two, three. Mm. Okay, so it tastes very fruity. That's what it, it does is. taste really fruity. You know what? Let's add that milk. Milk. Add a lot of milk to mine because I like to drink milk. So this box of Captain Crunch Birthday Crunch was not that expensive. Um, we definitely even the cereal looks like um, Easter colors. Oh yeah, it does. Uh, that's because the one time when we were going to the next one, we're trying to get those Easter colors. This did we feel so. I'm trying to think of what the difference is from the regular or any other ones that they have made. The difference is like um this kind is like a different flavor. Shape. So it's just like the oops berries. Cam was saying. What? He says like he probably thinks it's like a different shape. I think that. This is just like the Oops All Berries. It just doesn't have the um, this little square pieces in the regular um, red box or uh, regular yellow box. No, Mom. This one has it and that one. Mm -hmm. So the yellow box is the Crunch Berries. Blue is the Oops All Berries. Either way. Because the blue, because the blue are berries, um, mm -hmm. are the same one as this one because it's the same shape. You guys like this cereal? Mhm. Mm I think this is cool. I didn't realize that it was their 60th birthday. Um, Captain Crunch has been around a long time, so I am 29. So obviously, Captain Crunch has been out uh, way longer and than I have been on this earth. <laughs> Here, I got it. I got it. Bye. Peace. And today, I think that um, to start my morning off right, I am going to go in that coffee shop I went in yesterday, finish off my gift card, um, and be done with it. I don't go in there, and I don't know why our PTO keeps getting us gifts from there. Like, I hate winning gift cards to the coffee shop that I never get to go to due to the fact that, like, it's always so crowded. So, that's what I'm going to do. Go back home. Um, looks like I don't have much of anything to do, which is a good thing. So. So basically my Saturday morning started off by going to get Chick-fil-A for everyone else other than me and my mom. 
who end up ordering first watch there was a car show going on while we were there so i was not able to film going in i did bring my order back to my grandmother's house got a iced coffee this has no flavoring in it it just tastes like a straight coffee with creamer and like some syrup um i did get a side of scrambled eggs along with the bacon and the french toast with the bananas strawberries and kiwi on it amazing eventually we drifted off to goodwill where we did find a couple of good items i just didn't film while in there because it was just crowded we eventually then drifted off to walmart i found the carol's daughter's um, kit right here i think it is eleven dollars and 88 cent i definitely want to order one of each um, just because that is the type of product that i like to use in my hair um, later on in the evening we drifted off to shenandoah joe's they do like some pastries but also like coffees so here are some of the beverages that they have i end up ordering two um, vanilla lattes that were extra sweet um, because I don't like just straight coffee I want to be able to taste some type of flavoring and my favorite is vanilla so when we went out to go to Shenandoah Joe's I basically wanted to go out and use my gift card so we adventured off to Michael's where we found everything was 50% off for the summer decor um, and so I found a lot of great things that I would love to use in my household next year um, As well as like some 4th of July stuff. So I did include that this was a really good time for me to record and um, Get some reels going and things like that. And of course with the stuff being 50% off who can beat it? It was like I said some really great decor that you could add to your living room your kitchen bathroom if you chose to and of course i can't go anywhere without playing with her in the store with something like this too funny but like i said just really great time a really great time to record and create reels and show people that this stuff is 50 percent off you know like if you want to decorate or do a summer party this is your place to go Meanwhile, I did have a $25 gift card to Michael's that I wanted to use from my kids from the end of the year. Um, and so I did not know what to get with it, and I never do. So I just let Skye pick up something um, of something that she would like to do over the summer. So she did end up picking up um, a total of three box three boxes of things to do because it was buy two get one free which is a really great deal especially because they were only $7.99 we eventually went over to Ulta because I wanted to make sure I got the new tree hut birthday cake flavored um, body scrub and happy Sunday um, it's my first time coming out all day um, well no no I take that back I'm on my way now to go get some dinner. So I just made the Trader Joe's um, Jamaican patties, which was kind of like a late lunch. Didn't even realize that I couldn't put the Jamaican patties and the Bambino pizzas in at the same time. So what I end up having to do um, was say forget it and I was just like, I'm gonna go get Domino's. That's what I'm gonna do. And been watching All American from the beginning. So, that, I've been doing that since about Wednesday, Thursday. So I guess it'll take me another couple days to finish it, y'all. If you have not already started, started. All I can say is, Certain moments make you feel like you are really living in what they got going on. But anyway, some things this week that I have coming up, honestly, is nothing. Um, next weekend is the my grandfather's family reunion, so I'll be serving food there. And then I'm going to try to sell some of my crafts there so that he can, you know, make his money back and stuff. Like cookouts are a lot of money um so we'll see what we'll 
I hope that you all enjoyed this quick weekend vlog where I just did a little bit of everything but tried to switch it up differently and include shorts rather than showing everything that I did. So if you did, please be sure to consider hitting that subscribe button down below, hitting the thumbs up to let YouTube know that you like this type of video, and also letting me know that you like this type of video. Thank you guys so much for watching and have a great day.